am now going to show you how to create an appointment, add an appointment, view your list or requested appointments. So first you must select appointment management. Here you'll find four different transactions. The first is new appointment, appointment requests, appointment list and filter appointment. I'm going to select new appointment. So here you'll need to choose from your service list that you will have provided before. I have an example service here which I'm going to select. Someone from your staff, so I have Marie Gomez here just as an example. And your customer list. So here you will find your customer list of your ongoing and previous customers. You can add a new customer or even select from your contacts. Just to show you an example, I'm going to add a new customer fill out their details I'm going to now provide just an example email address their phone number their gender mail submission status I'm going to say send and you can even add their date of birth so I'm going to select this I'm not going to add a customer note but you can provide this and then just press save so I have now created a new customer so here you'll find two of my customers so Saffron Thomas and Marie Gomez so I'm now going to select Saffron Thomas I'm now going to choose a date for her appointment, notification of mail submission I'm going to keep a send so this will notify my customer that they have an appointment on April 16th. For the appointment time I'm going to choose 12.30 and then move on to write a note for myself just as a reminder I'm going to write haircut and possible balayage and then just create new appointment. I have now created an appointment for Saffron. I am now going to show you what appointment request is. So if you click on appointment request, you will find any of the requested appointments that your customers have sent you. And then if you move on, you'll find appointment list here you'll find a list of your appointments for the selected date, so I'm going to select 16th of April. For this day you can see that I have an appointment with Saffron Thomas for a haircut and a possible balayage. Here you'll find the appointment times, their mobile number, you can delete this appointment. You can also select arrived, waiting or did not come. As you can see, after showing you where to find your appointment lists, I'm going to show you your filter appointments. Here you'll find all of your appointments filtered for whichever specified date that you want. So I'm going to start off by 22nd of February and for the end date I'm going to choose May 5th. So for the staff choice you can choose whichever staff that you want to see their appointments. So I'm going to choose Marie Gomez. Their appointment statuses I'm going to carry on as all appointments but you can view any of the appointments that have been arrived to, did not arrive, waiting, cancelled or rejected. You can also type a name for the customer filter and the services provided. So I'm just going to go on and search and here I found two upcoming appointments. So here I have Saffron Thomas and Marie Gomez, so one for the 16th of April at half past 12 and for Marie Gomez, it's the 5th of April at half past one. 